Saluton para las Tomaso. Hi, it's Tomaso here, and I am on a mission today. I got a request, um, or I saw a comment the other day from somebody who was working through this world word build exercise, and he said he had a question about the uh, sound in it, and I couldn't play the sound because I have not progressed to that point in the tree. So my plan today is to see if I can unlock world word build, which means I need to get at least one star and all the levels before so i'm just going to jump right in here and start testing out um of course if you guys have any comments or questions uh, please leave them in the chat i will check that out in a little bit um if you are working on if you're learning esperanto now it might be a good time to bring up duolingo on your own device and uh, work on your own exercises okay here we go i had the honor of i had the honor to present the president to her so it's got to end in al she Mi habis la honoron presenti la president presidenton al she. Quick note here. Oh, I got to turn my sound on. I forgot. Um, quick note here. This is um, the Duolingo course has actually. I understand they made a conscious decision to not include the word presidento. Presidento would be the president of a state or a country. Um, that's actually the more common word for president. Presidento. Presidanto, it would be the president of an association or a company or something. Okay. Homai Raitoi, human rights. I'm just going to crank through these as fast as I can. Tiu simbolo aspectas kiel ovo. Tiu simbolo aspectas kiel ovo. That symbol looks like an egg. An egg. I believe that's called the centennial symbol. It's a green. It looks like two E's, one E facing left, one facing right. Respectu la reguloin. En vi progresos pli... Nope, that can't be it. Respectu la reguloin que vi progresos pli rapide. Respect the rules and you will prog progress ne more yujumin. quickly. There's Ruth. Can she do us? Ne yujumin. Ruth, mi ne, yu, mi ne yujas vin. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. Me. Boni. Se li farus pli da laboro, mi respectus lin pli. If he were to do, farus, if he were to do, would do maybe? Um, if he would do, that's probably did. If he did more work, if he did more work, more, more. If he did more work, I would respect him more. I would respect him more. The confusion here in English is that uh, did can be past tense. It can also be subject, sub, sub, subjunctive. If he did more work or if he were to do more work, I would respect him more. Se li farus pli da laboro, mi respectus lin pli. Homoi volas pli da liberezzo kai egalezzo. Homoi volas pli da liberezzo kai egalezzo. People want more equality and, no, more freedom and equality. More freedom, more liberty. There we go, liberty and freedom and equality. Fratezzo estas pli bona ol malamo. Fratezzo estas pli bona ol malamo. Brotherhood is better than hatred. La publico electas la comitaton. La publico electas la comitaton. The public elects the committee. Mi parolas en la nomo de la provisora registaro. I am speaking. Mi parolas en la nomo de la provisora registaro. Let's hear that again. It's real nice and slow. Mi parolas en la nomo de la provisora registaro. Mi, la, mi parolas en la nomo de la provisora regis, registaro. All right, there we go. I am speaking, speaking, speaking in the name, in the name, the name of, I am speaking in the name of the provisional government. I always think of Star Trek. Shoot, what was the name of that Star Trek show? Deep Space Nine. I am speaking in the name of the provisional government. Mi parolas en la nomo de la provisora registaro. Ni chiwi profitos de la pazzo. We will all profit from peace. Ni chiwi profitos de la pazzo. 
And I'm not going to click on the here. Yep. I bet you there's a discussion. People want to know why. People want to know why there's um, a the in one sentence and not the other. We'll see if actually that, that actually does come up. Um, you know, I'm, I'm going to look at that later if there's time. Mine comprenis la situacion en la lando. Mine comprenis la situacion en la lando. Mine comprenis. Mine comprenis. I did not understand. I did not understand la situacion en la lando. The situation in the country. Oh boy, okay. Kiu yu jos la concurson morga? Kiu la Who will judge the competition tomorrow? Demando signal? La occidenta land limo de Rusio estas longa. La occidenta land limo de Rusio estas longa. Okay, the western border border of Russia is long. The western border of, oops, I left the name of the country off. The western border of Russia is long. La occidenta land limo de Rusio estas longa. Chitiu partio estas ne nur por malriculoi. Chitiu partio ne es, uh, estas ne nur por malriculoi. All right, this party is not only for poor people. This party is not only for poor people. Chitiu partio estas ne nur por malrichuloi. Donu al ni pacon. Donu al ni pacon. Donu al ni pacon, pacon. Donu nu al ni pacon. Donu al ni pacon, pacon. Pilino, ¿qué al vine cantas? Mines siestian canton. Ah, no boni. Do eble por la venonta foyo, ni por vas canticune. Donu al ni pacon. Donu al ni patson. Donu, give us peace. Al ni. Ni electos mezan voyon. No, ni electos mezan voyon. We shall choose a middle way. And shall is an alternate form of future. I actually did not know that. All right. Since I'm testing out here, I'm just going to get these last few wrong on purpose. All right. so let me see how I'm doing here. I'm going to go and then I will check in on the next step here. This is the Esperanto Variety Show, where every Thursday we have new videos in Esperanto and about Esperanto. We also have live streams on Wednesday. Um, as we can. So far, we've been able to do it every week for the last 11 weeks. So uh, keeping that record going. Um, and yeah, so there we go. So this shows that I have not unlocked anything new. Why not? Oh, because I've got to do business. All right. Well, let me just make a quick change here. Um, I do. Like I mentioned I have. Um, I have. Uh, new videos every Thursday. And another thing that I do is I have I live streams have. on the on the Salivanto channel. Um, and yeah, so let me just see who's watching. We've got a couple people. Lance, Paige, Holly, Kai, Aida. Haha, ha, Bonan Canton, Duncan. Okay. Seven people watching. Thanks, guys, for watching. Thanks for the two thumbs up. Appreciate that. Okay, so let me come over here to my notes. Um, in the past, I have had some problems with my Chromebook crashing in the middle of the live stream, so I'm trying something different <laughs> this week. Rather than opening up all the um, discussions ahead of time that I want to discuss, um, look at, I, um, I've got the links in this little scratch file here. So, yeah, this is to remind me what I want to do. So, yeah, if you guys have not already subscribed, I imagine if you're watching this live, um, you probably are subscribed using the bell. Um, but there's also the channel Salifanto, 
which um, this is where I do some additional live streams. And um, I'm going to try to put some more language learning tips out here. But for now, it's mostly just live streams. Um, I did a sequel to the Quitting Spanish video. By the way, that one has started r ranking in search, which has been very interesting. <laughs> I was surprised to suddenly get all sorts of comments. Um, yeah. So uh, that I, I thought there was one person that was kind of gaslighting me or something. But, um, yeah, so let me see. Mi hay orelo y doloras. Chutio esas pro la lautezo de la sono o chula canto ne estis bona. Ah, ni minas tias. Bone. All right. So once again, if you guys want, have any questions or anything you're working on that uh, you'd like to know more about or something you'd like to comment on what's going on here in the live stream, let me know. Otherwise, I'm going to try to see if I can crank through and um, just basically my goal this, today is to see if I can test out and uh, open up the whole tree here. Whoops, I did the wrong one. I'm doing a, I, I want to do a test out, which means I need to click on the key. I was thinking that was a light bulb for some nutty reason. All right, jump to level one. Here we go. Kiel mi povas subteni la komunumon? How can I? Kiel mi povas? How can I subteni la komunumon? How can I support the community? Chu vi havas? Do you have a permit to enter our company? Chu vi havas permes silon por eniri nian firmaun? That'd be the first one. La butico comerzas de frua mateno gis mal frua vespero. La butico, la butico, that should be a shop, okay, yep. La butico comerzas de frua mateno gis mal frua vespero. The store does business. De frua mateno, from early morning. Where is it? From early morning. Gis mal frua vespero. Until late in the evening. Until late evening. The store does business from early morning until late evening. La butico comerzas de frua mateno, gis mal frua vespero. Quiom estas la saldo en mia conto? How much is the balance in my account? There it is. How much is the balance? Is the balance of my account? Let me read that back. Kiom estas la saldo de mi conto? How much is the balance of my account? I don't understand the plan at all. I remember doing these with Lee Miller. <laughs> By the way, we're going to have Lee Miller back. He has uh, said he's available to come back, and I have some other interesting guests who have told me that they would like to be guests on the live stream. Um, so I just need to schedule the, the exact date with, with them, and then we're going to Announce, try to announce that ahead of time so you guys can plan ahead. Um, if you have any suggestions about who you'd like to see on as a guest, let me know and I will try to get them um, within reason. And uh, if you would like to be a guest yourself, we, uh, in the past we had um, Everyday Esperanto, who is an Esperanto learner. Uh, he and I worked on Duolingo together and I thought that worked out pretty well. So uh, be sure to comment or leave a comment in the chat. Um, if any of, if you have any thoughts along those lines, I don't understand the plan at all. Mi tute, mi tute ne comprenas la planon. Se vi ne, pova, se vi ne povos montri al mi la quitanson, oni ne repagos al vi monon, uh, la monon. Oh boy, nice long, you know, I'm going to type this in. If you cannot show me the quitanza, what does quitanza mean? Receipt. They won't give your money. All right, I'm going with, if you cannot show me the receipt, and that's actually future tense, um, or should be, they won't give your money back. It, no, it didn't like it. If you can't show the receipt, they will not refund the money to you. I'm going to report that as it should also be accepted. Bing, bang, boom. To do that is your responsibility. Farition estas via respondezzo. And I got to spell responsibility, right? 
to do that is your responsibility. Do the plans work? Chula plano y funcias. After post la resulto la curso estis terura. After the result, the curso, the exchange rate, right? Curso. Curso. Que on signifas curso? Yeah. After the result, the exchange rate was terrible. Pagula manjon per credit carto se vi ne havas monon. Okay, contantan monon perhaps. Pay the meal with a credit card. If you do not have money, pagula manjon per credit carto se vi ne havas monon. La economia condicioi del en la lando estas nun pli malbonai. The economic economic conditions in the country now are worse. La economia e condicio e la lando estas nun pli malbonai. La quitanzo estis en mia monuyo, sed mi ne trovas gin. I'm going to do this as a tap. I tap the words for this one. The receipt is in my wallet, or was in my wallet. Was in my wallet. But now I don't find it. But now. But now. Oh, it doesn't say now, does it? Said me ne trovas, Jean, but I don't find it. Huh, the only choice I have is I can't find it. I think this is wrong. Yep, in fact, I'm going to click on discussion on that one. And come back to that later if I can. Kio estas nia plano? What is our plan? What is our plan? Kio estas nia plano? Existas asocioi por comerci esperanto. Oh, this one. Existas asocioi por comerci esperanto. There exists. Yeah, there, there exists. There are, maybe. There are associations to do business in, to do business in Esperanto. There are associations to do business in Esperanto. Existas asocioi por comerci esperanto. I think we discussed La this one. The newspaper, La Gazzetto. Uh, La Gazzetto Ciam Parolas Pri Economio. The newspaper always talks about, always, always talks about the economy. So the question is, do I add the word the in there? I'm going to say no. No reason to. Yep. Baldau she comerzos externe. Soon she will do business abroad. Soon she will do business abroad. Baldau she comerzos externe. All right, I'm going to type this out because it's long. Why does that? Oh, I'll read the sentence. Kial tiu firmao malsparas nian tempon tiel. Why does that business? And is that firm? Waste my time like that. Why does that company waste my time like that? Was the alternate choice? Oh, oh you got to say that again, voice of Duolingo. Here we go. Oh, ho, uh, oh, ho. Oh. Let's say that again. Ho, oh, kia estas mia permesilo? Oh, <laughs> I say that three times a day. Holy smokers. Oh, where is my permit? <laughs> Diablo, me forgesis me permesilo. All right, and so I'm just going to skip these last few because I think I'm... All right, I'm going to check in with you guys, how everyone's doing. Uh, and then we'll poke around a little bit. Where is... I gotta remember which tab I put you guys in. All right. Lance... 
Lance diras, la sonorilo ne funkcias bone por mi, mi jam šaltis ĝin, sed mi ofte ne ricevas sciigojn aŭ ricevas ilin tro malfrue. Yes. Um, Paige diras, the receipt sentence doesn't like the word me. Hmm. Ĉu mi mistypis ion? Bone, des, yes, do, um, yes, do fakte, do, la ĉefa afero estas ke mi volas ĉiam fari tiun elsendon je la sama horo. Um, mi efektive ankoro ne decidis ĉu ni povas fari tion tiel, sed mi pensas ke ĝi ja funkcias sufiĉe bone kaj do eble ni, ni ĉiam, se mi ĉiam provas fari ion ĉirkaŭ tiu horo, do inter la unua horo kaj nu, la tria horo laŭ la, laŭ la Novjorka hor, horlogio, laŭ la Novjorka horzono. I have a little question about vocabulary that I cannot understand even when I search in the net. It is not important, maybe a silly question, but I would like to know if you know the exact meaning of the word offend. Or does it mean to offend somebody or to trans trans transgress a law? All right, so let's do this. Let's come over here to vortaro.net, which is the online version of the new version of PIV, Plena Illustrita Vortaro. And we will look up offendi and see if we can make sense of it together. Okay, offendi, it says it's a transitive verb. All right, so you offend something or someone. Let's read on. And it's colerigi au chagreni iun mal respectante ties dignon. Aha. Uh -huh. So to make someone angry or chagrined, frustrated perhaps, mal respectante ties dignon. So while disrespecting the dignity of that person. All right. So to me, that sounds like offending a person in that case. So here's some example sentences. Example sentences. Postulo ne pretendas, refuso ne offendas. Okay, that's a little bit heavy there. Kiu premas malrichulon, tiu offendas creinton. Uh, okay, so if you put pressure on a poor person, you're offending the creator with a capital K. Yeah, in that case, I do think it has to do with offend. She estis certa ke jam neniam she ek murmuros contra la mano kiu shin offendos. So she was certain that she had she she never will ek murmuro. She will never say anything. Never mutter anything against the hand that offended her. Okay. Yeah, and that one's, you know, a little bit slightly broader meaning, it seems to me. But anyway. Mine povas plu toleri ke oni min tia maniere offendu. Muso ciam lakato offendas. All right. The second one is Mal res the second definition is mal respecti. This it says senton. Right? So, so yeah, it's the same sort of thing. Offendi ies pudoron. Tio offendas nian lingvan senton. The second one's a better one. This one offends. So the second example is that offends our, la our language sense, our sense of the language. So, so, in addition to offending a person, you can offend a feeling. So I think the answer is you don't typically off offend. Like we talk about an offender in the English. You know, somebody breaks the law, he's an offender. Uh, it doesn't seem to me that Esperanto has that meaning. Okay. And by the way, I don't think that was a non-important or a silly question. That was actually very interesting. So thanks for that question. And let me uh, just run down a few things here before I get back to my goal of trying to see how much of the tree I can unlock today. Uh, this is a quick preview of the video that I have for tomorrow. Um, the target audience is not necessarily actually you guys, uh, but um, Esperanto Variety Show has reached the 4,000 hour mark. Um, and uh, so I thought I would pay it forward a little bit. I know... Um, I had received a question. Somebody said, would you be willing to help um, mentor people who are learning about creating, uh, making their own YouTube channels, especially for Esperanto? 
And uh, I had actually already filmed this one video where I give a little bit um, of information about what I do to run the channel, what my goal is, and, and how I how things I do behind the scenes to get there. So that's what's going on tomorrow. Um, and the video was already available for my patrons. Um, yeah, okay. So then we've got uh, just a reminder that you can subscribe to... Um, subscribe to the Salivanto channel and uh yeah oh yeah one more thing um i'm gonna take a minute here to talk about some of the comments i get on um on my channel on my videos and i i say in the description of my videos that esperanto variety show is viewer supported um and as i was copying that text today into the description of this video i started thinking well Usually we say something's viewer supported if if they don't have ads and uh, Esperanto Variety Show does have ads on it um, and but I just want to make sure everybody understands that the ad revenue is actually very small um, and uh, one guy let's see if I can find a comment um, somebody showed up on my channel and started leaving comments and uh, he doesn't seem very uh, yeah this is this uh, this here's his first comment. He talks about um, the review of Complete Esperanto and calls it disgusting that people would actually uh, ask for money for an Esperanto textbook when people could be spending their time better on, on other things. Um, and then, for some reason, the same guy came, uh, came back and watched some more of my videos. And he said, the idea of a planet-wide IAL is not feasible. And... Uh, so I asked him, you know, why are you watching the videos if you're not interested in the topic? And uh, so I asked him for some, he asked him, and he said, this is what he said. He said, you are getting money from people watching your video, so please try to be more respectful. Um, and so that's when I, <laughs> that's when I stopped reading his message. And I wrote this back to him. Stick it in your ear. <laughs> <laughs> that's about all the respect I owe any, anybody for the literally two cents I get if the viewer happens to click on an ad. So, all right. So that's what I mean by viewer supported. There's actually a lot of interesting comments here while I'm here on this page. I'd mentioned that this video that I'd done about um, giving up on the Spanish course on Duolingo, um, that's suddenly ranking in search. So I'm getting a whole lot of... Um, a whole lot of comments from people saying, how did you escape? They're threatening my family. Looks like your parents are fine. How do you, please tell me, how do you escape from Duolingo? Um, and it goes on and on like that. There are lots more of those comments. And I actually deleted the first few because I thought somebody was really threatening my family. <laughs> I didn't realize it was part of this meme. Oh, and now I feel bad about that. But anyway, that's about all I can do at this point is move forward. Yeah, ad, yeah, page says ad revenue lit literally equals cents per day. That's true. Yep. Um, and I think especially, I think I'm I think I'm technically not supposed to see how much I get in ad revenue. So uh, that two cents is actually just a, a wild guess based on other reports that I've seen elsewhere. Um, yeah, but um, they, measure, they measure ad revenue in terms of thou a thousand views. And most of my videos um, uh, have around 500 views. So... Um, it really is just sense. Um, but anyway, um, so that's why I am grateful to the people who are supporting this channel. And uh, salute Don Alena. Says bona vidivin. Facte mi havas demandon por Alena. Kaj mi ne scias ĉu tio estas publike aŭ ne, sed mi aŭ ne, sed mi scivolas ĉu vi havas iujn informojn pri Twitch kiu vi povas afiŝi. Ĉar mi scivolas kio okazas tie. Ĉu estas iuj bonaj uh, uh, oh, I just opened two more. All right. So how close am I to the end? All right, I got half an hour to go. Let me see if I can test out a spiritual. Um, all right. I'm not, I usually I'd like to suggest that people do the light bulb icon for the tips and notes, but my plan today is to see how much of this I can crank through. Double rainbow. Oh, my God. Oh, that's a full rainbow all the way. 
Double rainbow, oh my god, double rainbow, it's a double rainbow all the way, everybody, damn, double rainbow all the way, damn, oh my god, let's see, ni vanku ni ein timoin, we overcome, ni vanquish, let us vanquish our fears, let us vanquish our fears, I should probably do this, Oh, it took it. Good. <laughs> I was thinking I should probably do the tap words on this one until I know what words it really wants for as translations. Um, yeah. Vi devus ma fermi vian menson. You should. Or you would have to. Let's see. Would have to. See if it's. If you devil's mal fermi vian menson, you would have to open your mind. All right, there we go. We all aim for the good. Ni ciui celas la bonon. Ciu bieno appartenis al liaite avoi. All right. Ciu bieno appartenis al liaite avoi. This farm belonged to his parents. That farm. Eh. Stick it in your ear. Oh. <laughs> Ilia religio havas multain festo tagoin. They must be uh, Pastafarians. Their religion has many holidays. Oh, I am not afraid of fear. I am not afraid of fear. Pro shiai bonetso kai belezzo, chiwi amis shin. Ah, yes, so we have shiai and then two singular nouns. Because of her bonetso kai belezzo, goodness and beauty, chiwi amis shin, everyone loved her. Because of her goodness and beauty, everyone loved her. Pro shiai bonetso kai belezzo, chiwi amis shin. All right. Mi maltrafis la diservon en mia pregeo, char mi vecigis tro malfrue. I missed the service, the church service perhaps. No, I missed the service. I missed the service en mia pregeo in my church. Charmi vekigis troma frue because I woke up too late. I missed the service in my church because I woke up too late. Mi maltrafis la diservon en mia pregeo. Charmi vekigis tro malfrue. Fratezzo estas la spirito de Esperanto. Brotherhood is the spirit of Esperanto. Mi ne certas. I am not certain. I am not sure. Chumi vere credas tion. Whether I really believe that. Whether. Whether. I really. Believe that. Mi ne certas. Chumi vere credas tion. I am not sure whether I really believe that. Kion diris la pastro pri pecoi? Kion diris la pastro pri prek? Pri pecoi. Kion diris la pastro pri pecoi? What did the pastor say about sins? What did the pastor say? Pastor, minister, what did the master say about sins? Demando signal. Menso clara en corpo sana. Ah, yes. Who can tell me what that is the slogan of? That's mens sana en corporo sana. It's a famous Latin phrase. A healthy, a clear mind. A clear mind in a healthy body. In a what? A, whoops. A clear mind in a healthy body. Kiam la prelego pri judismo kai cristianismo ocasos? I'm curious if anybody. Mi tre shatas twitch. Tommaso estas cantema. Mi estas cantema ciutago, effective. Char, um... <laughs> yes, do fact is it. 
mi ne ĉiam kantas en tiu viva elsendo. Ryan Ridgeway demandas, ĉu iuj scias, kiel duo aldonis tiel malbonan aŭdon al Esperanto arbo lasta tempe? Um, ok, so, why is, there, why is there low quality uh, audio on the Duolingo tree? All right, so this is what I know about that. Um, the, as of, I think, well, in the last summer, they, um, <laughs> Lance, you're killing me. <laughs> as of last summer, um, they, Duolingo had decided not to add any more of the professional, um, professionally recorded audio to the, to the course. So that meant that if there was a problem with the audio, the only choice was to uh, delete the sentence or, or, um, remove the audio from it. They've since added um, an option in the incubator to allow course contributors to record their own audio. Um, and so it's actually been in a lot of courses that they have, uh, people have been raising concerns about the new audio. Um, there are um, a couple new guys. So there's, we say there's the male, that's the voice of Duolingo guy that we've heard several times already today. Um, and then the woman's voice that we heard, um, some people have described it as the, uh, the, the old woman in a bathroom, um, <laughs> which I find to be a terrible description. Um, although I can see why, because of the echo. Um, and I can tell that she's been uh, finding a better way to record, but it's, yeah, it's basically people at home who volunteered to work on the course. Um, they have a choice of giving you things to listen to or not. And uh, yeah, uh, some of the guys, there's actually a couple guys um, and I don't really know if they want me to call them out by name. There are some that I really like. Um, occasionally the volume is a little lower than it needs to be. Um, but uh, yeah, um, there's a couple women's voices. Uh, one of them is, is a woman from Brazil and uh, I think she has some very good sentences out there. Um, and there's some other guys that, some, quite honestly, I, I think uh, leave something to, to be desired. And so these guys need to work that out amongst themselves, how they're going to make sure they've got good equipment to record on and a good environment to record in, and that uh, people who can pronounce clearly um, and dynamically should probably be the, one, probably be the ones to um, volunteer more. But ultimately, it's just give, to give people something to listen to. Dankon Alena, uh, saluton Jason, kai esto lens diras pecoe bon gustas kun butero, kai dias ver ridige. All right, so let me see if I can finish up this level. Kiam la prelego pre judismo kai cristianismo o casos? When, capital W, when will, oh my gosh, why is such crazy long sentences? When will the lecture? When will a lecture about Judaism and Christianity happen, take place, take sun, take place? There we go. When will the, whoops, ah, oh, Hubbard, sweet mother Hubbard. I left out a word and I got to start over. Dang you. When will the lecture about Jew, oh, you know what? Am I going to get age black because I said, oh, sweet mother Hubbard? I hope not. Judaism. I don't know how to spell Judaism. Probably capital J. And Chris, C-H-R-I-S-T-I-A-N, C-H-R-I-S-T-I-A-N-I-D-Y. Okay. When will the uh, take place? When will the lecture about Judaism and Christianity take place? Check. There we go. Chuvi estas cristano. Chuvi estas cristano. R-U-A-C-H-R-I-S-T-I-A-N. Se via interna vivo estas en ordo, via extera vivo estos en ordo. Se via interna vivo estas en ordo, via extera vivo estos en ordo. Your exter... Oh, so if your inner life is in order, your exter... External life will be in order. I like that. Islamanoi kutime prejas kvin foyoin tage. Islamanoi kutime prejas kvin foyoin tage. I'm going to do a word bank on this one. Muslims. Muslims usually. 
Muslims usually pray five times a day. Pray five times a day. Islamanoi kutime prejas kvin foyoin tage. Ooh! Remember the sentence. Islamanoi kutime prejas kvin foyoin tage. In fact, I wonder if now might be a good time to do segue into this. This might be fun to do. One of the sentences that I had chosen was has to do with ta, the word tage. There it is, tage kai nokte. Let's see what this question is and see if I can answer it. I did this kind of quickly and I don't actually remember what the questions are. Um, <laughs> so can we say ili dormas tage? So here's the sentence. Kiam ili laboras nocte, ili dormas dum la tago, kai vekijas en la vespero. All right. So, I'm going to answer this question. It'd be interesting to see if anybody has a different opinion, but I can see why the person who made the sentence wanted to say dum la tago instead of tage, right? I don't think I can highlight this because this is, this is clickable text, but yeah, here it says dum la tago. And the question was, can we substitute the word tage for um, dum la tago? I'm going to say it depends on the context. Sometimes um, it can mean per day. For example, and then we can go back to that sentence we were just working on. Islamanoi kutime prejas kvin foyoin tage. Hopefully that's a good enough answer. All right, there we go. Cross that off the list of questions to answer. Yeah. Ye kioma horo komenci la di servo. Ye kioma horo la di At what time? At what time does the service, so di servo, di servo is a specifically a religious service, but we don't usually use the word religious in our translations. At what time does the service begin? Ye kioma horo comencijas la di servo. All right, so, and because this is as, tempo, I would understand this to mean a service that happens on a regular basis, right? So every Sunday at 11 o'clock, there's a service because it's present tense. Um, if I, if it were, if we were at a weekend event and somebody had decided on their own to include a uh, Esperanto language, um, uh, di servo, and there was only one, I would expect the sentence to be, ye kioma horo comencijos la di servo. All right. I'm going to see if I can skip some of these. All right. I don't think I unlocked any more skills. Let me check into the chat here, see how you guys are doing. Uh, help is mean I esto, Elena. To facto, mi demando estas chu. No, yes, to mi esploras aliain. Persono in kiwi shatas el sendi vive. Kai facti estis do el canalo Bruhilda. Kai she lernas esperanton. Kai she el sendas en en Twitch. Kai mi spektis kalkain afero in de she. Kai estis tio kiu iumete inspiris tiun ideon. Kai mi si volas chua liai persono el sendas en esperanto. Kai kion ili faras. Do sa sa kiel saluton. Uh, Alena diras, mi, mi iomete de logigis de ali lingvai el sendo en Twitcho, ki a mi malcovris ke estas bela kai inter subtenema musica comunumo de lernanto e gis profesiulo. Y esto tio es la afero, esas multa afero en, en la vivo. Do Alena chu vi curajas, uh, anonsi vian, uh, Canal adreson, tiel ke ni povas 
sekvi vin en Twitcho, dien tio estis mia vere mia mi comprenas que vi nur provisore tes kai teste faras sed eble tio estus interesa boni all right for those of you just joining my plan today was to see how much of this tree i can unlock um and uh quite honestly i think i've gotten closer and i might wait until next time um because i would like to answer some questions uh and take a look at the forum a little bit just for something a little bit different um this is one of the sentences we were sentences we were just working on la quitanzo estis en mia monuyo monuyo said mi ne trovas gene and my concern working through the exercise was the original one said i don't find it and the translation says, I can't find it. And so Donaldo demandas, wouldn't, can't find, um, be something like, mi ne povas trovi. I'm going to say, I tend to agree. To agree. There we go. But I'm not going to copy this and bring it to the attention of the course authors. I don't think it's a horrible, horrible mistake. All right. Nichiwi profitas de la pazzo. Oh, and I left it without the word the in there, and I wanted to know if... Interesting. I, I So my question was, when I was working on the exercises, whether they wanted the word the in English. I seem to recall that was my question. And according to this answer, no, you can be... You, because I think I did it without, and it looks like you can do it with. This person said, this was eight months ago, we will all benefit from the piece, and that was marked wrong. So it looks like that has been added as a correction. So, I mean, as an alternate answer, so that's good. All right, so now I am back at my... See, the spelling checker is going a little crazy here. All right, so let me... I'm going to delete the ones that I've already answered, so I don't have to look at them again. All right, so the first sentence that I have is called, You Dolt. Um, <laughs> dolt, of course, is a not a very nice name to call somebody. It suggests that the person is stupid or awkward or foolish, and that's my uh, definition without looking it up. Um, and here's the sentence. Pardonu, mi ne estas Sofia. Sorry, I am not Sofia. Question is, I typed Sofia with a PH and not Sofia with an F. The program counted it as wrong. And Ben24150 says, that's because the answer is Sofia with an F, you dolt. Not a very nice thing to say. And uh, I'll be honest, it's pretty common that I will see things like this and people will say, why is this wrong? And I'll say, because it's not the same as the answer that you see at the top of the page. Um, and sometimes I just choose not to answer those questions. And sometimes I say, well, what kind of clarification are you looking for? Um, because certainly I don't know that person's situation. Um, and I think at this point, it's not my business to add anything <laughs> to this conversation. So we're going to move on but yeah spelling spelling does matter and the, the i'm pretty sure all the english sentences should accept sophia with an f um that was the way that's the that's the main accepted translation there there are quite a few that accept ph as an alternate but i think they're all supposed to accept f um yeah so you have to somehow learn how to spell sophia in order to do the course here let me get another, I don't need this open anymore. I can come back to that if I need to. All right. Rizzo. I forgot what this has to do with Rizzo. Let's find out. Rizzo. Rizzo means rice. So, why is Tsumi Mixas Latstone Kun La Rizon wrong? All right, so here's the sentence. Do you drink milk? I'm sorry. Do you mix milk with the rice? Chuvi mixas lacton kun larizo. And the question is, why is chuvi mixas lacton kun larizon wrong? 
Um, and again, this is uh, another case where I say, well, because it's not the same as uh, the original sentence, right? So I've got to think the person meant to ask something else, like why is there no N? Or why is there no N on Harizo? Maybe that's the question. So again, this is why I wrote this blog post because this question comes up all the time. And I'm going to say uh, there are a few typos in your answer. But if your question is why there is no N on Rizzo, this blog post, that, that's because, that's because B-E-C-A-U-S-E. -E. All right, there are a few typos in your answer, but if your question is why there, why is there no N on Rizzo, that's because Kun, and put that in italics, Kun is an ordinary preposition. Kun is an ordinary preposition. See this article for more detail. All right, let me make sure I got that correct. There are a few typos in your answer, but if your question is why there is not an N on Rizzo, that's because Kun is an ordinary preposition. Okay. Do you mix the milk with the rice? Chuvi mixas lactone kun la Rizzo. All right. Alena, kiu lingvo vi parolas de nasque? Ah, interesa de mando. Yes, vera, Alena. Kiu lingvo vi parolas de nasque? La mondo volas ci. Oh, Brian Ridgway volas ci. Facte, nu. Alena efektive estas fama en Esperantujo, sed mi ne malkasos tion detalon al vi, si mem devas <laughs> ah, faifi la propran uh, hupilon, au oh, minestias, hupi la propran tr tr trumpeton, au oh, surmeti la propran strumpetoin. Yes, boni. Do. Ien alia demando, ien riso. Uh, demandas petas, yen alia of the demando, ni trovu la demandon, ciun semainon mi vidas tiun demandon por foie, kai la demando estas, kia ci estas, kio estas la differenzo inter demandas kai petas, what is the difference between demandas and petas. So let's get the context here. And that is, she ne shatas peti helpum. She doesn't like to ask for help, right? So if we had said demandi helpum, that means she doesn't like to ask help a question. But she's not asking help a question, she's requesting help. So I'm going to say demandi in italics. Demandi means to ask someone a question. Petty means to request something or ask for it. How's that for an answer? Demandi means to ask someone a question. Petty means to request something or ask for it. All right. There, that question's been answered. Yep. All right. Moyosa, she is das angla lingvano. Compreneble. Boni. Do yen de manas caipetas. Um, oh, yeah, here's another one. Somebody used the word obvious. I remember this one. This question, as I'm clicking on it, has to do with being on a chair or in a chair. And the person used the word, and I wasn't going to really say anything until the person used the word obvious, and I thought, ooh. This might be something worth paying attention to. Oh, this is actually very interesting because I did not I did not read this sentence in context when I was getting ready for the uh, live stream. Um, 
And I was thinking in terms of being on a photo, sur photo. All right, so let's get the context here. I didn't realize I'd, or, I'd already commented in this thread. All right, that'll make it easier to leave a short comment. Here's the sentence. La virino sur la rulsejo estas diplomato. The woman in the wheelchair is a diplomat. So the question was, uh, why is it in and not on? Yes, bonnet. Um, and so somebody actually apparently knew the answer and decided to offer it as a freebie. If anyone is confused as why it is sur and not n, think of it like this. A cup is a container, so things can be put in it. A wheelchair is still a chair and doesn't contain anything, so people can sit on it. So the person commented, interesting. In English, we sit on a chair or a bench, but in a wheelchair or armchair for obvious reasons. So here's going to be my snappy answer. Obvious to whom, right? Um, I don't think it's obvious. It's obvious if you speak English that you sit in a in a chair. In fact, I almost think you can sit. Um, who's sitting in this chair, right? I think you can say that even if it's like a folding chair or a kitchen chair. Um, it doesn't have to be an armchair. Um, but uh, we know we have to learn that. We have to learn these things things. We have to learn that chairs, armchairs and stuff um, are treated mentally like containers. Um, and this is what I, this is, this is my initial response. I said other usages, which surprised me when I was learning was sur la arbo means on the tree. So if you climb up into a tree, you're not actually going inside the tree. You're just sort of going in sort of the, uh, the leafy area of the tree. So you're on top of the, you're on the tree. Uh, in the sense, you're sur la arbo, in that sense. And the same thing, sur la foto, that can describe somebody who's in a picture. So I don't know how obvious that really is. Don't agree with the word obvious there. All right. Well, I want to know, everyone know, that I am having a lena fenomena. Mishatastion. Tamara neamara lena fenomena. I'm having a lot of fun today, and I'm tempted to keep on going, but um, life goes on. I don't want to test anybody's patience here. Um, oh, I want to read these. I want to read the rest of the chat, though. Okay, let me see here. Uh, all right. So, Lance diras ho mineniam pensis pri to take place kiel alia signifo de okazi. Yeah, it happens. Take place. When does this? When does this? Cotus deans happen. When does it take place? I don't see a big difference. Post poste kiam, this is Alena. Poste kiam estis ocaso pruvi mian parol capablon de nove. Ancao tius pertis pli bonijon. Okay. Um, sen esperulo faris. Yeah, I found I found his channel, um, and I think he had one video that I was able to see. Uh, oh, Elena Fenomena. I, oh, I see. That's your Twitch name. Okay, good. Yep, I'll try to see if I can find you. Um, yeah, now I understand. Okay. Tomaso, viscias que mi netro emas trupet hupado. Que el vidiras. Mi netro emas. Bueno, do tio restos nia secreto. Tio estos via superpotenso. Okay, ser esperanto, esperanto lern... Nantoi kai sen artistoi en nuna epoko konas min de foya instruado chenask kai de kino teatro festivalo kiun mi ekigis en dumil de katri. Esperantistoi kiwi lernas en la antawa epoko es eble konas min de pasporto al la tuta mondo. Do yes, fakte eble tio esus, ja esus bona maniero fini la el sendon. Um, mi pensis compreneble pri uh, la familio bonvolo kaj pasporta la tuta mondo, sed ni ankaŭ povas antaŭen rigardi al nask, um, ĉar estos bona jaro en Esperantujo, en parte en Nordameriko, mi opinie, post kelkaj semajnoj, mi, fakt, post unu semajno, mi pensas, mi pretiĝos por iri al, al Norda Karolino por per, do mi instruos tie, Kai, uh, do en Norda Carolino. 
Do, es ne estas tro malfrue plani vian kunvojaĝadon, a kaj se vi loĝas en la oriento, en Ohio aŭ Pensilvanio, uh, mi havas iom da tempo por vojaĝi antaŭe, kaj mi serĉas gastiganton um, por halti survoje, mi kaj mia filo. Do, se vi volas havi okazon paroli esperanton uh, antaŭ la fino de la monato, bon volu anonci vin. Kaj Alena instruos dum nask, ankaŭ en Norda Karolino, je la alia flanko de la ŝtato, en Julio, aŭ tio estas, mi ne memoras precize la unuan tagon, sed en la komenco de junio, uh, pardon, en la komenco de junio, kaj la fino de ju... Oh, diable, mi ne povas paroli. La fino de junio kaj la komenco de julio. Yeah. Boni. Nies. Estas la dua horo en Novjorkio. Restas fakte kelkaj demandoj, kiujn mi ŝatus demandi. Um, ne, ne, no, it does not. Which goes first? And his teenager said, um, yes. Do tion mi eble devos respondi alian fojon. Yes, do boni. Do refoje, dankon por spekti. Uh, ne forgesu um, la kanalon Salivanto. Um, se vi ŝatas tiun formaton, bonvolu aboni a tiun alian kanalon. Um, mi fakte, mi volas rigardi, ni ja havas pli ol jen la kanalo. Ni havas to kvardek, kvardek du. Um, fakte, mi povas montri to jen. Oni povas klaketi sur tiu por aboni, kaj klaketi sur la sonorilon por um, ricevi anoncojn. Kaj foje, verŝajne, tiu funkcias, foje ne. Se vi ne, ne jam klaketis sur la sonorilon de Esperanto Variety Show, bon volu fari tion. Yes, mi, ne, mi ne volas aboni propran kanalon, ĉar mi ne volas fushi la... Diable, kio okazis? Mi ne volas fushi la uh, statistikojn, sed jen tio. Bone, refoje, dankon pro via atento kaj intereso, kaj ĝis la venonta fojo. Ĝis.